What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we're just gonna look at Flex by Polo G uh, featuring Juice Wall over here. Uh, so we just got no cable for this song. I don't want to worry about the structure. Uh, There's not, nothing much complicated. Same thing actually going throughout the whole song. It's not like a rap song, obviously a rap song. So uh, we don't have much guitar pass away. Just one finger picking over here. So first let's have a look at the chord progression. Uh, before that, just dive into the chord shapes. First chord gonna be a B minor, which is mu two four four three two. Our next chord we have is G major, which is three two zero zero three three. Our next chord D major, which is mute mute zero two three two. Our next chord E major, which is mute zero two 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 zero. So that's nice and easy. So we know the chord shift now and guys for this song when we are actually doing finger picking pattern uh, we are not applying this pattern on this basic chord shift we are just actually playing the power chord shift uh, don't interpret, misinterpret this as the power chord these are very easy to play power chord shift so we got the B minor power chord which is a 2 which is 2 4 4 on the A D G string you can just slide the shape on the 5th fret and it's gonna be a uh, D and then over here we got the E string 3rd fret, A string 3rd, 5th fret, D string 5th fret is a G and it just come over here it's a A which is 5, 7, 7 so we know everything now let's dive into everything I mean finger picking sorry uh, so basically what I'm doing is I'm playing I'm picking the, e, the bass note and the D string uh, like I'm playing the A string and D string twice with these two fingers and then I'm plucking the next string with the index fingers so it's like so basic finger picking I hope you know this you can actually use a pick high note picking but I like to pick for this part so have a look at the tab we're doing I told you the chord progression follow that uh, we are playing the A string and the G string twice plucking together then we're playing G string so we got I just slide over here on the D major over here so it, it will be which is same thing you're doing same pattern and then you come to the G chord over here uh, and you just pick the E string and D string doing the same uh, thing what you did for the uh, uh, last chord but for this time we just interchanging the string to the E and D string so we're playing the E string and D string together and then E string so it will actually sound something like this one two three four pause the video practice and then just play along with me one two three four That's pretty nice and easy. Uh, uh, now let's have a look at the chords, uh, showing pattern and all. Uh, for this section, guys, due to the chord progression, B minor, D major, G major, E major. Uh, now let's have a look at our right hand. We're actually going. We're just doing a down, then a up, and we're just keeping on the, the uh, hand on the string to get the sound muted. That's pretty basic and easy. I'm just repeating this once for each chord. That's as simple. I'm just gonna play this once for each chord, and so let's see how it sounds. One, two, three, four. For this song, guys, you just know everything to play this song on guitars. Uh, you can actually jam on. So that's everything for this lesson. I hope you enjoyed this one. Let me know in the comment below any song that you want to learn by uh, Apology. 
Uh, and see you guys back in the next video. And don't forget to subscribe, guys, because I'm just gonna do a face reveal, a guitar reveal at 1K subs. I'm really working hard Friday. See, I just got um, online classes, but I'm actually missing those just for you guys. I'm just going on giving guitar tutorials and all. I can actually check. Uh, so that's it. I don't want to say much. Uh, see you guys back in the next video. Bye.